back and forth sort of interview. So introduce yourself okay. and uh, tell us what went on tonight and uh, describe some of the, uh, the things that went, went on uh, in the meeting and how the democratic process is uh, shown in, in how things went on tonight. Right. Uh, my name is David Stieber. I'm a history teacher hey. on the south side at Team Engler High School. Um, and so tonight we had a union delegate meeting to decide on to extend or end the strike. Uh, we decided to extend it for two days, um, basically because we wanted to take it back, the proposed contract, back to our teachers, have them see it, have them talk about it, understand it, then take it to our communities, hopefully talk to our parents and our students and just people in the neighborhood to explain it more. Um, and so it's unfortunate that it's going to take a couple more days, but we want to make sure that everyone understands it because we're actually modeling the purest form of democracy right now. And as a history teacher, I'm pretty well versed into what that should look like. And so it's a lot different than what goes on in City Hall. And so we're trying to actually show what real democracy looks like. So you were your union delegate. Uh, how many uh, union members did you represent uh, in your coming here tonight? I got a smaller school, so it was just 40. 40? Yeah. Okay. So uh, basically, did they give you the, um, the authorization to um, uh, call an end to the strike, or were you simply told by your 40, uh, 40 constituents beforehand right. to bring the contract to them? I mean, so we, I've been talking to them over the weekend through email and text and phone calls. Um, so it was just, they kind of wanted, they had their issues, I knew what their issues were, what they wanted to make sure was in the contract. Um, and so it just came down to, I know basically what they want to say, but I want them to actually see it, you know, and actually just make sure that I'm not, you know, just reporting it and I don't miss something here or there, but they can actually look through and miss it. Because with 188 pages, there's a lot in there and I can summarize it and do the best I can, but I don't want to miss something that, you know, may be small for me, but something important for them. And so when there's things like special ed and clinicians and all these different professions or parts of careers that I'm not, I sometimes miss those other things. So that's what I want them to see. Well, thank you so very much. Thank you. Uh, can I get spelling your name again? Is yeah. it B or a B at the end?